Commuters in Brantford were taking aim at Via Rail today. They're demanding the passenger rail operator get their daily train to Toronto back on track so they can get to work. Al Sweeney has the story. These protesters in Brantford say Via Rail has knocked their lives off the rails, leaving them with a tough decision to make. Well, now we have to drive to Aldershot to get the train so we can get to work on time, or we have to quit our jobs or move. So I want to speak to those of you who relied on Train 82. The protesters rallied at the Brantford train station today to call for the reinstatement of Train 82. It was the train early in the day that got people to work in Toronto in the morning. It was just a nice, quick um, commute where you could actually work on it as well with uh, the Wi-Fi and, uh, and get into work on time. The train was suspended when ridership dropped off during COVID, but it hasn't come back, meaning commuters have to find another way to get to work. How long does it take you to get to Toronto now? Two and a half hours, one way. Commuters say it's too much. Um, it's unsustainable for me to drive, uh, to have a two and a half hour commute. I can't do it. I'm burned out. We're seeing people making that decision either to either up and leave and move closer to Toronto to reduce their commute or to continue to wait it out in the hopes that Via Rail would return. Brantford Brant Member of Parliament Larry Brock says quiet diplomacy hasn't worked with Via Rail. He and the mayor are now going to take their case directly to the head of Via Rail in Montreal. You know, we deserve to have the same kind of commuter rail service that other parts of the GTA have. They say COVID measures are over and they want their train service back. It would be a huge relief. Yeah, the, the, the stress would be uh, alleviated. Bring back train Bring back train we contacted Via Rail today but haven't heard back about when or if Train 82 will run again. Al Sweeney, CHCH News.